Hi, in this video, I'm going to show you how to use the Angle Adobe XD plugin. First, head over to angle.sh and then click on account. We'll need to download a few mockup devices from Angle in order to use them with the plugin. So click on download for XD and it will download the package containing all the mockup devices that we can use in Adobe XD. Once the download finished, double click on the zip file to unzip it. When it's done unzipping, go into the folder and you'll find a few folders there. The cards folder contains all the mockup cards. The comms folder contains all the compositions. And we also have the Android devices, the desktop devices, as well as the iOS devices. Finally, we have a plugin folder with the plugin itself. So it's an .xdx file. To install the plugin, you simply need to double click on it and it will prompt you with an XD model that asks you if you want to install the plugin or replace it if you already have it. So click on the blue button to replace or install the plugin. Once this is done, you will see a success message that tells you that the plugin has been installed. Click on OK. When the plugin is installed, we'll need to add a mockup to XD. So let's go into the iOS mockup and I will select the iPhone 13. It will open the file containing the mockups and I will simply select one. So let's say this one. So I'll copy it. Then I will create a new file and this file will be an iPhone 12, which is about the same size as the iPhone 13. So I will paste my mockup right beside my frame. Next, I need a design for my iPhone 12 frame. So luckily I already have a screenshot here. So I'll simply drag and drop it on my frame and then resize it so that it fits my frame. Now that we have our frame as well as our mockup, it's time to select our screen layer. To select the right screen layer, I suggest you to click on the layers tab here on the bottom left corner and then double click on your mockup and it will open the contents of your mockup. So for the newest iPhones, you need to select the screen layer that is a mask group. So the mask group is the group with the icon as a little square with a circle inside. If the phone or the device mockup that you have doesn't have a group mask like this, you should select the layer, which is a path called screen, like this one here with a little pen as the icon. So in this case, since I have an iPhone 13 and we have a group mask, we should select this one. Now that it's selected, we need to run the plugin. So let's click on the plugins icon, which is the last button on the bottom left corner. Then we will run the angle plugin and click on apply mockup. Here you can select your frame, then set your pixel density. 1x is the default resolution and 3x is the maximum resolution. You can also rotate your frame up to 270 degrees and you can also flip your frame. Then click on apply mockup. Now you can see that it applied the mockup right on your screen. So this was how to use the angle plugin for Adobe XD. Happy designing!